Arkansas has become one of the top 10 peanut producing states in the nation, and industry officials believe production is here to stay. The sandy soils of Northeast Arkansas, which are ideal for cotton production, are also suitable for growing peanuts. When cotton prices plummeted in 2011, and peanut industry officials were looking for new farmers to offset a shortage of production in other states, a number of farmers in Randolph and Lawrence counties shifted acreage to peanuts, taking advantage of prices that neared $1,000 a ton. Two buying points were built to clean, grade, and store the nuts after harvest. Though the prices dropped by more than half the past few years, yields have been good enough to allow the state to achieve the status of being a major peanut producer. For that, we needed to uh, produce 10,000 tons for a three-year period, and we, we did that successfully and have continued to reach that mark and exceed that mark for the past several years. So uh, the production's here to stay. I don't think this is a flash in the pan type of thing. Uh, the buying points give the stability, and I think it's gonna be around for a while, and it's something that uh, people are taking notice. That consistent production also allows Arkansas to have a seat on the National Peanut Board, giving Arkansas growers a voice in policy decisions. Production last year was just under 17,000 acres. Travis Foskey, a plant pathologist with the University of Arkansas System Division of Agriculture, sees room for possible expansion. They're gonna continue. Uh, they have bought into it, they bought the equipment, and so they're gonna continue production. But we do have a lot of new growers that see the benefit from it. I think we're at a point where we could use another buying point um, to be able to sustain the production. I think there's grower interest. Jeremy Baltz is co-owner of Ag Headquarters Buying Point in Pocahontas. They're currently storing about 10,000 tons of peanuts in this warehouse, which are awaiting shipment to shellers in either Georgia or Alabama. They have growers who have invested in specialized planting and harvesting equipment, and seeing how a rotation with peanuts improves yields with other crops. He's bullish on their future in Arkansas. They're a good rotational crop. Uh, a lot of our growers are seeing large, you know, 10 to 25 bushel increases in corn following peanuts. Um, so it, it's a good rotation there. I think growers are adding some of those economics into their decision. For some of the smaller growers that, you know, are growing in the, you know, several hundred to a few thousand acres, it's a way for them to extract more revenue and more profit out of their acre. And so it, in essence, it's a way for them to grow, grow their operation without having to grow their acres. Peanuts are here to stay. I think they're a good crop. They, they offer us, you know, just another, you know, uh, it is still a niche, but, but for some growers, it's much more than a niche. Um, for, for guys that have the right soils, the peanuts has been a way for, for them to really, you know, turn their farm around. 